Hello everyone, how are you doing today? This one we're gonna I'm gonna show you guys how to open it up and how to upgrade the mechanical hard drive or replace your mechanical hard drive with an SSD drive. This particular one is an HP laptop uh, model 14-CM0005. This applies for any in uh, near model ones. So first thing first, you need an opening tool. For the opening tool, I'm gonna use a guitar pick. This guitar pick is a metallic guitar pick, has a soft edges so it doesn't scratch or harm the laptop and is really tough to bend. So what thing we're gonna do, we're gonna open, uh, remove the back rubber and the front rubber at the laptop on the bottom cover. To lift it up, just snug, stick the guitar pick right underneath and then pull the rubber up, pull it in 45 degree angle and stick it right beside it. Same thing with the front rubber. Just put it right there, lift it up. Always make sure you lift up in one direction. Do not bend over 90 degrees. You're gonna crack the rubber. Next, I'm gonna use uh, my iFixit tool set. Uh, we're gonna use number zero, Phillips number zero. I really like this tool set because the, the bits are really tough. They don't go bad. And I'm gonna stick a magnet right on beside it so I can lift up the screws. I don't like magnetizing the bits. So remove the, the screws. The only two exterior screws are exposed. They have the colored black and the rest, everything is the same size. It's colored in white color or whatever color is this. Like a silver color. Uh, once you removed all the screws, what you want to do, you want to open the laptop in 45 degree angle and then you want to stick the guitar pick between the top and the bottom cover and you want to wiggle it around, twist it, not too much, you want to hear those clicks, that's what you want to hear, you do the side, all the way back, all the way to the other side. and then close the lid and then just lift up the bottom cover. Simple as this one, the hard drive is right here. There's a one ribbon cable goes to the motherboard. You want, you want to disconnect the ribbon cable by just pulling it up 90 degrees. Just lift up this flip thing 90 degrees and then pull out the flex cable. Now you can just go ahead and lift up the hard drive. Yep. This is one terabyte Western Digital Blue. And now to replace it, you're gonna need this adapter. So there's an adhesive tape right there. We'll put apart it slowly. Remove the SATA connector. Grab your SSD drive. Any SSD drive, doesn't matter the size. You want to remove the rubber, put the hard drive to one side, grab your SSD, place it right there, close it, make sure there's a rubber leggings hole there, it has to go through the hole, and then grab the SATA connector, stick it right there, and then place the hard drive, solid state drive right there, and then connect the hard drive. In this case, I'm not actually going to replace it, just for the demonstration just showing you guys how to do it and if you want to replace your mechanical hard drive same thing grab the new mechanical hard drive place in the caddy and place the connector right in there and then put it face down make sure it's nice and snuggled in there lift up the cover for the in this cover right there and stick the ribbon cable right on underneath evenly, hold it all the way down and then close this hinge right there. And that's how you upgrade your SSD drive or your mechanical drive in this model. And the last thing is to grab the bottom cover, place it right on top, and then press on the corners and on the front, you're gonna hear clicks. That's what you wanna hear, all right? 
and then what you're gonna do you can lift it open up a little bit and then and then pinch wherever you think is open on the sides at the back check everywhere all right and the last thing will be to put the two black screws in the front where it was exposed and the rest the uh, plated uh, screws right under the rubber legs and then you should be all set if you guys have any requests you know where to leave them in the comment area i'll try to answer them as soon as i can also i really appreciate if you guys click that like button and subscribe it really helps and motivates me to make more videos answer any questions and the last thing is to grab the bottom legs i mean the rubber legs and place it in there and then run it down all the way to across same thing for the back one we start where there is a bump right there place the bump right where the screw hole is and then make sure you run it straight down all the way down to the other side there we go i really hope you guys like this and enjoy this video and if you guys liked it you know what to do thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video